Alright, here's a word problem. They want us to find the parabola whose vertex is 2, negative 5, containing the point 4, 7, and they want us to write it in standard form. Standard form, to remind you, is the one that looks like this, y equals x minus h squared plus k, with actually a number out in front of that as well, a times x minus h squared plus k. That's standard form. So how do we do that? Well, let's start by writing the equation, y equals a, we don't know what a is, times x minus, this is h and this is k, minus 2 squared minus 5. So what I did is just plug those things in here and here. And um, notice that I, the only thing I don't have yet is a. Let's, re let's recall what we did back in Algebra 1. In Algebra 1, we said the slope is 5 and a point is 2 comma 3, write it in slope intercept form. And we already have the slope, we need the intercept. So we're going to use the slope and this point to find b. So here was our equation, mx plus b, remember this? And we wrote y equals 5x plus b, and then we plugged in 2 and 3 to find b. We're doing that exact thing but we're doing it for a quadratic. So we have, we have the vertex, we have h and k in this equation, and now we just have to find a. See how that's the same kind of concept? And that's what we're doing. So let's do that. All right, so let's we'll do that by writing 7 is y, 7 equals a, which I don't know yet, times 4 is x, 4 minus 2 squared minus 5, and I'll just solve for a. So 7 equals 2 squared is 4, 4a minus 5, add 5 to both sides, 12 equals 4a, a equals 3, it's a positive 3, so now I rewrite my equation. Here's my answer. y equals 3 times x minus 2 squared minus 5. And that's the answer in standard form.